So you can uh, get a hold of us, Ben and Kelly Show on social media. We got this message from Aaron, aka hey, Ben and Kelly, a A Ron. Yes. yes. Uh, hey, Ben and Kelly, love your show. Thank you both. Are the goats of Louisville radio? Aww, Thanks, thank you, A Ron. <laughs> Thanks, A Ron. <laughs> I've heard you talk about the silly and awkward deal breakers that people have with their relationships, but it's been a while, so I thought I'd tell you mine. I just discovered I have. Okay. I've been on the dating scene for a couple of years. Well, I just started seeing this nice woman. We seem to click. She's a couple of years younger than me. We hung out for a couple of months before I discovered this, quote, deal breaker. Okay. So in that time, I had never seen her car. We always met out, or she would take Anyway, we decided to grab some dinner. This past week, she picked me up in her nice BMW. That's nice. That is not the deal breaker. Okay. It's the fact that she had those big eyelashes over the headlights. <laughs> like, why? As a grown man, I had to get into a luxury car with eyelashes. <laughs> I told her, nice car, in the hopes that she was going to tell me that she was actually borrowing it from her 18-year-old sister. Nope, it's hers. Okay. Couldn't shake it. Thought about it the entire time at dinner. It became my obsession with trying to figure out what possessed her to decorate her BMW with eyelashes. (laughs) The closest thing to an answer I got without needling her like a jerk was I thought they looked cute. Okay. So, yeah. I didn't realize up until this point that I had a silly deal breaker, but now I can honestly say if you're a grown woman who has a luxury car with eyelashes, I'm out. (laughs) (laughs) My friends are already making fun of me saying I'm missing out on a rich girl because of a couple plastic eyelashes that she'll grow out of, and that may be, but I just can't. Okay. So I told her that we were moving too fast and I wasn't ready to get into a relationship right now and broke it off. Oh, God. Yep. Thank God she broke up with her. (laughs) Yep. You may say I'm a jerk, and I will fully accept that, but I think I am was happier to learn that I have a deal breaker now. Oh. Anyways, <laughs> I thought I would tell you in case you wanted to talk about it and other crazy deal breakers people have so I don't sound so shallow. Keep up the great work. You can say my real name because I'm currently single. Oh, my God. A. A. Ron. A. A. Ron. If you don't have eyelashes on your car, he'd like to He'd like you. to talk to you. <laughs> wow. <laughs> he probably would not have given me the time of day either when I was driving the Volkswagen Beetle that with the Daisy had the, wheels. Had, 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 yeah, the the I had the Daisy wheel caps. wheels. Yeah, yeah. Yes, they were actually with the yellow centers. Yeah. And yes, it looked like a Daisy. Alloy and, wheels, but they were shaped like daisies. And didn't it also come with like a little... A vase a in vase. the dashboard that I yeah. put a flower in. Yes, yeah. I did. A daisy, yeah. yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, like a yeah. true flower child. Yep. Well, <laughs> this is how I know that I, I married the right man because he drove that car. There you go. Yes. There you go. And got compliments at stoplights. Absolutely he, he did. Because <laughs> he rocked it, of course. Yes, he did. With confidence. Like, yep. It's my ride. <laughs> he found out he had a deal breaker. Yep. That were uh, the eyelashes on the, the head lashes. Yep. <laughs> the head lashes on cars. Yep. See, so Sassy and Mike, he is like, listen, tell him to find her out, rip them off. Then he can reconnect with her and continue the relationship. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Just like be a ninja in the night, sneak up, take them off. And then disappear. Yeah, Bethany and now says she's okay to date. Bethany says just let her be happy and be goofy. Like exactly. Okay, okay, I get it. And maybe, maybe he was trying to figure out more uh, like of a psychological thing. Right. It she sounded like, like maybe nope, it was just like thought it was cute. Yeah, thought That's it was. All cute. It was. <laughs> like they were hand me downs from my. Grandma. They were hand me downs from my <laughs> grandma. They're relics. They're heirloom head lashes. <laughs> <laughs> that that my mom had and her mom's mom had. I just I and can't break the tradition. Can't break the tradition. Uh-huh. Yeah, absolutely. Nope. And I just thought uh, when I was at the BMW dealership, the associate that sold me the car told me, "You know it would look great. You know it would look great." <laughs> <laughs> and I said, "You know what? You're right, yes. sir. You are right. My girl needs eyelashes." Right. 
All right. Um, I don't know if you want to roll in, maybe confess a silly deal breaker that you have. Aaron's yeah. right. It's been yep. a minute since we've talked about it. We've talked about this on the show before, but sure. But you know, if you'd like to share yours and make a a Ron not feel so bad, <laughs> then share them on Facebook. It's posted at Ben and Kelly Show. All right. <laughs> We're just talking about silly deal breakers because Aaron rolled in and said, "Hey, I didn't know I had one, but apparently." A girl that I was seeing for uh, a couple months, I found out she decorated her BMW with eyelashes. <laughs> and I was like, like, I'm out. Deuces. <laughs> yep. Can't handle that. I just discovered I can't handle it. <laughs> I just, uh, I discovered that was my silly deal breaker. So, uh, yep. pl- now, Tish has got a list. She's rolling in, not a petty deal breaker, but I have a list uh, when I was dating. Not like six foot with brown hair, but rules, and they never failed me. Number one, you must work. Mm. Doesn't matter what you do, but no scrubs. Okay. Uh, number two, must be nice to wait staff and service people. Yep. Number three, must return carts. Okay. Number four, must like animals. Yeah. Number five, must not refer to ex's mom, sister in any derog- derogatory way, crazy bees, that kind of stuff. Yeah. And number six, must be able to handle bad traffic without having road rage. There you go. I mean, that's, hey, that's a good, uh, good guide right there. I think that's a good set of rules. Uh, Vanna, for sure. Yeah. Vanna says not liking cats. Does that count as silly? Because that. Okay. Er- okay. Erica says not riding all the rides with me at Disney World. All right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Angela does roll in and says, uh, that one girl dodged a bullet. She has a BMW and is successful. Let her have some fun in life. Exactly. Yes. Bethany says, as far as like, um, Deal breakers, guys who are obsessed with their car or sports, totally okay to have hobbies and interests, but when they become your entire personality, that's a deal breaker. Okay, yes, understood. Ashley says, deal breaker for me, short guys. Not sure why, I've always liked taller guys. Mm -hmm. And she says, you know, under six foot tall, I'm 5'3", so they have to be taller than me. Mm. Mm. Well, that counts me out. No, it doesn't. You're taller than 5'3". I am. I'm not six foot, though. I'm, no. I'm 5'10". Oh, yeah. Well, I guess. She said, she did say she needs, she needs you to be six foot. Six or foot, older. right. Oh, boy. Uh, and then Amy says, I only went out with this guy a few times. Showed up to one of our dates with nostril hairs protruding oh, aggressively from his nose. <laughs> he went in for a kiss, and it looked like an octopus of hair coming oh, in for the kill. <laughs> I pretended to get sick, ended the date, and broke it off shortly after that. <laughs> can't, can't handle oh, the nostril hair, huh? Aggressively protruding nostril hair that looked like an octopus coming for her. <laughs> I mean, and that's something that could be taken care of. He probably just didn't just, pay much attention. He probably just didn't know. He they make nostril know. hair trimmers. Yeah, and then finally, Amanda just referring to the... Um, uh, the BMW with the eyelashes. Uh, she just says, hey, someone's going to find her and match her freak. Exactly. That's right. And how many, how many of us are going to be driving around today looking, looking for the eyelashes? BMW. Yes, exactly. <laughs> every BMW we see, every car that we see that has eyelashes on it, we're like, is that a BMW? Oh, <laughs> is, that, is, that a, is that a BMW? <laughs> oh, She's I love gonna it. find her person. I, I know it. Yep. Yep, for sure. All right. Hey, thank you, Aaron. Thank you for all the, the stories on that on 9970JX.